rise sixfold. The Bank's app allows its customers to send and receive money without physical packets. Other banks, such as Standard Chartered and Citibank, are also encouraging its customers to send cashless red packets using PayNow. DBS Bank is upping the ante by piloting its loadable QR red packets, which it says is the world's first. After users load a cash value into unique QR codes, they can give the QR red packet away to someone. The recipient scans the same QR red packet, and the amount automatically goes into their DBS mobile wallet. With this QR um, uh, unbound, Actually, we are now able to bridge this, this gap, okay, where we can marry tradition, customs, practices, uh, where it's extremely important, uh, to, you know, to the Chinese New Year, with a physical uh, red packet uh, and with a QR unbound with value inserted in there. So to preserve this whole uh, greeting and exchange and the giving uh, practices that has been uh, embraced uh, by not only Chinese, but any Singaporeans today uh, who celebrate Chinese New Year. Hotel Janet Tangman is also emerging technology with tradition. It teamed up with its adopted charity to develop red packets that come alive. Now to see these birds come to life, you can scan the red packets using a mobile app. And you can even capture the moment with a photo or video. Now red packets make use of augmented reality technology to digitally animate the birds on screen. But, will innovation and technology replace actual red envelopes? One red packet printer doesn't think so. It's been in the business for 30 years, and during its heyday, the company would print nearly 70 million envelopes during the Chinese New Year season. Ten years ago, I think Angkor is quite uh, simple, just uh, uh, normal paper and those uh, gold stamping only, gold and red only. And I think 11 to 12 years ago, uh, they start to using those uh, colorful ones and change to the more premium paper material, uh, bring up the quality and the design look, look more colorful. From there on, this 10 years change. This year, it's producing half the number of envelopes because of stiffer competition from other market players and the move to go digital. Yet its chief designer says the art of creating red packets remains. I personally still thinking is that high technology regarding how advanced this Angbao um, is uh, traditional for New Year. This is our Chinese culture. This is only one thing celebration our New Year. It's a happiness and fun. <laughs> With more creative use of designs and materials, companies like Caston hopes physical red packets can still stay relevant in the digital era.